Hey guys, it's Sam. So I just wanted to do this quick video because today I got Zeus's bark box and he's oh super excited as you can tell totally. Um, I already kind of opened it up but I wanted to show you guys what it was and what I get out of it. So it comes in this cute little box. It says bark box on it and I get an extra toy with it. You can get an extra toy or you don't have to. That's up to you. But like this year, it came with um, coupons and stuff. So if you guys want um, something like that, let me know. If you're interested in signing up, I'll send you a coupon, like a freebie thing. Um, so what it is, is it normally comes with three to four toys, um, and I get I get an extra toy. So normally it would come with two to three, but I get three to four. Um, now, sometimes they are really, um, sometimes the toys are not very durable. Um, so it's good for like, you know, smaller dogs or dogs that like to genuinely cuddle with their toys. But for my dog, because he is like a fucking wolf, he likes to destroy all of his toys. Um, and he needs things that, he doesn't like a lot of squeakers. He likes things that he can just, and he likes ropes and stuff like that. So you can specially request to have harder toys, tougher toys, um, you just label them, you message them and just say, hey, my dog is a, is a, is a hard chewer uh, or a heavy chewer, and they'll send you like the harder toys. But this month, so what they do is they send you, because if you get the extra toy, they'll send you like three to four toys. This month, I got three big toys. Um, so there's like this little witch's brew pot, and it's, it's squeaky, but, like, obviously it's hard to show you guys because it's a video, but, like, the fabric, I don't know if you guys can see this, it's super durable. Like, it's really durable. A lot of the toys that I've got, I got in the past before this, they weren't very durable, but the, this is, like, really durable. Oh, and they make it so that, you know, you can pull on the rope or and whatnot, so, so that's the first one. <laughs> Zeus is like, oh, die! So then the second one is vampire teeth. Rum, rum, rum. And if you put it, if he's biting ah, that, he's smiling with vampire teeth. So, but this is made out of like a really hard squeaky ball. And then this is just some hard fabric and whatnot. But <laughs> I got to get this on video, guys, because this is funny. Hold on. Okay, here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Do you got vampire teeth? <laughs> he loves his toys. He loves his toys. <laughs> so that is the second one. <laughs> You're so funny, Bubba. So that's the second one. And then the third one is actually glow in the dark, apparently. It's this really weird rubber. I don't know. Yeah, that's definitely glow in the dark. It smells... I think this is scented. That's weird. It smells like vanilla or something. That's really weird. But um, I got hair on it because he was chewing on it earlier. And then the third toy is rope and a ball. And apparently this is glow in the dark, which is fun. So, woohoo! <laughs> and then on top of the toys that you get, you also get... Um, you get you normally get like a little pamphlet or something cute. This home gives out friendly dog or gives out dog friendly treats. I'm gonna hang that. Um, I'm gonna hang that outside uh, on my door on Halloween. But on top of getting the toys, uh, they also send you two to four treats. It depends. Um, this month I got ooh I don't know here let me turn it this way so you can see a little bit better green bark gummies with Nutrichia what's that say no artificial flavors wheat corn soy or wheat gluten grain free there's 40 of them in here that's awesome skin and coat Natural duck, apparently, made in the USA. Whoop, whoop. 
Uh, let's see here. That is awesome. Mm, ingredients. The first thing is duck and then pea and, you know, healthy stuff, not all that added junk. Look, they're so cute. Let's see. Green bark gummies. That's awesome. Okay. So this is the first pa pack of treats. And then normally they'll send you like a beef jerky stick, which I really like because it's a nice quick treat if I'm, you know, if I'm going to be gone from the house or, um, you know, I, I'm going to be gone out shopping for a while and I need to give him a treat. Um, so Play-Doh pet treats. This is cool. Doggy treats. And then I also got these bacon dog treats. That's interesting. Healthy dogma. <laughs> Made in the USA. That's cool. Let's see. Made with USDA inspected human quality bacon. I could eat this. That's awesome. Guys, look all that's in that. That's it. Barley, bacon, oats, peas, tomato, canola oil, cranberry, carrot, sweet potato, celery, beets, parsley, and watercress. I can read all of that. That is good. If you can actually read it, that's a good thing. Because some of these treats that we give our pets, they're they're not they're not good. They're not healthy and you, if you can't read them, there's a problem. I also got I also got these other ones the other day. They're called Witch's Brew, Witch's Pumpkin Brew. I don't know. Um, but honestly, Zeus has not really liked them that much, so I don't know. I'll have to try and get him to eat them again, I guess. I don't know. But I wanted to do this video because I like letting you guys in on what's going on with my life and my wonderful puppers. And, um, you know, he enjoys his toys, and we got that today, so I wanted to let you guys know that. Also, I, um, as you guys should know if you follow me, um, I am part of Melaleuca. Um, I have a membership with them, and I also am an affiliate partner with them. So if you guys ever want to sign up for Melaleuca, let me know. But um, I'm going to be getting a new box in the next couple of days, and I'll be reviewing all of the products over the next couple of weeks. That's going to be my my next kind of series. So, um I'll do that. Oh, guys, you guys you guys are going to make fun of me. My dog is so spoiled, okay? This is his container, like, or cart thing. So, like, we have, like, all of his, like, extra treats down here and his, like, his, um, his leash. And he has several bandanas and, like, costumes and stuff down there. And then normally his dog biscuits go in there. I have some more in my back bedroom but uh, that I need to refill but those are his dog biscuits and his swimming thing. And one time he had to have a cone, so there's that. And then his dental shoes because I'm super, super careful about, like, his teeth and everything. Um, this awesome thing that I love so much that has all of his just, like, loose treats. Um, this thing, guys, I really advise getting this. Um, it's a travel container. And you can, it has a handle, which is always nice. Let me see if I can do this one-handed. But, so it has a handle, and there's three bowls in here that you can take them all apart. So normally what I do is I put food, food, and I leave one bowl empty for water. But it's really nice if you're going on like a weekend getaway. Well, you're really only going to be gone two, like, two days. So, because you'll be home before you leave, and you'll be home when you get back that net, the couple days later. So normally two bowls is enough for him. And then a bowl for his water. It's nice for traveling or if we're going out to Eagle Creek uh, to go hiking here in Indiana. Um, I'll take that with me in case. Hi, baby boy. He's so cute, you guys. This is why he gets spoiled because he's such a sweetheart. And then since I've started fostering, I'm sorry, baby, I know i got to get up. Since I've started fostering, I've been keeping the cat treats and the cans of cat food, catnip, and uh, my foster files in there as well. So, by the way, okay, so that is his little thing. <laughs> He's such a goofball. 
You're a goofball. I love you. And then he also has several, like, he has two different containers here. Look, all of his toys lead a trail to his toy container, which he has a crap ton of toys in here, which most of these are from other bark boxes. Like, this one's from another bark box. It was, like, a for when school started in August. So, like, milk jug, you know. Um, this had another part like this on it, but it was, like, a s'more. He destroyed it. But um, it was for, like, camping and stuff in the summer. This was for the when the Olympics were going on. He likes this one. You like this one? <laughs> He's like, Mom, I got an itch. Um, oh, I think this was uh, another, I think because this was, like, July or something, and this was June for, like, the summertime like a palm palm tree or whatnot. And then and that this is supposed to be a pencil. I don't know where the where'd the bottom of it go. Oh, of course, you just want that. So there's lots of toys. And then he has another one back here next to his food. That also like I got him a Halloween rope toy. Um, I'm obsessed with Superman, so I got him that. This was when, uh, it was camp, it was the camping theme with the s'mores. It was also a roll of toilet paper, <laughs> which it's not. It's really just a crinkly thing, but, um, there's a burger in here that he likes a lot. Um, the very first one that he got, there's the other s'mores thing. <laughs> uh, the very first one he got was like a, their champion one, so he likes that. So, yeah, there's, that's not, that should not be in there. Uh, yeah, but there's lots and lots of toys. Um, but, <laughs> and I'll clean them up and he'll take them right back out. But anyway, so, I just wanted to show you guys all of that. Um, I'm going to be doing several different series over the next couple of weeks. The first one, I'm going to be reviewing all of my Melaleuca products that I have um, and kind of telling you why I like them and why you guys should sign up because Melaleuca, seriously guys, I wasn't buying into it at first. I didn't think that it was that big of a deal, you know. Sorry, I'm cleaning up all of his toys. Um, but I, I really, I wasn't interested in it. It didn't seem like that big of a deal. And it didn't seem like something that was, you know, had a ton of value or anything like that. But here's the thing. After I tried their products and realized how healthy they are, and since I've been trying to, you know, live a healthier... Give that back to me. Zeus. Since I've been trying to live a healthier lifestyle, it's it has literally changed my life. Like, I have their laundry stuff. And their toothpaste. And um, I think that's really, oh, and like their dog treats and stuff. But that's really it. That's all I've gotten so far. And I'm like freaking in love with it. It's so, like, it's so clean and friendly to the environment. And I don't know. It's just become a really big part of my life. So I just ordered another round. Um, if you guys want to sign up for Melaleuca or you're interested, let me know. If you're wanting to sign up for BarkBox, let me know as well because I have, like, you know, get your first month free or something like that. So let me know with that as well. Um, and, yeah, so that's, that's pretty much it for today. Um, I just wanted to kind of touch base and let you guys know what I'm doing. Um... I am still going to be doing, like, personal development coaching. And, and, I mean, here's the thing, guys. I want to help you. But I can't help you if you're not reaching out to me and telling me you want help. I, I can't. I, I physically cannot help someone who's not asking for help. So, if you are ready to get help... I would be more than happy to help you. And if you're ready to start on that journey, let me know. I'm going to be doing more personal training here um, soon, you know. And I want to be there for you guys. I want to be able to coach you, um, you know, in 
being physical, physically fit, being nutritionally fit, being mindfully fit, being emotionally fit. I want to be able to help you guys do that because I've been where you are. I've been to the point where you're just like, I give up. I give up. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. You know, and, and I've, I've been there. I've been there and I've been miserable. And now I'm out of that and I'm so, so happy with my life, you guys. And yes, there are days where I hate my life and I'm like, ah, this sucks. But here's the thing, like, there was a time where, you know, I was sleeping on my friend's couch. There was a time where I was in a really abusive relationship and taking care of a grown man and two kids by myself. Like, there were several times in my life, and I'm only 20, you guys. There have been several times in my life where I have hated it, hated it, and I've had to struggle and fight and claw my way to the top. And now I'm getting there. I'm out of that. And I have a better life now. I have an incredible freaking apartment. I mean, oh, oh. I, I mean, I, my, it's a little messy right now, but it's, it's a freaking awesome apartment, you guys. I work my tail off. And you have to be willing to work. There have been times where I've been working 60 hours a week on a full-time job and then doing a part-time job on top of that. So, you guys... I can help you. Let me help you. Message me if you want me to get you started, okay? Yes, I, you know, I, I have been through a lot, and I want to be able to share that wisdom with you. But I can't share it just on Facebook and hope someone sees it. It's one of those things where you have to come to me if you want the help, and I will get you started. But in order to get this life that you want, you have to be able to be willing to work for it physically, mentally, emotionally, nutritionally, financially, entirely in your life. You cannot just change one or two aspects of your life and expect something to happen. You have to change everything. Everything has to be changed. So message me if you guys want to get started. I want to help you. But that's enough about my rant. There's the bark box. Let me know if you're interested in getting one of those for your sweet puppy because I know that my dog freaking loves it and it's a really, you know, exciting thing that he gets every month that he gets to enjoy. And that way, I still buy him a ton of toys, but that way I at least I know that he will have some toys like every month. So, some new ones. So, Message me if you're interested in that. Like I said, I'm going to be starting the Mellow Luca stuff in the next um, couple of days, start reviewing that. And then I'm also um, going to be doing, I'm probably going to be doing videos on how to get a website set up if you're wanting that. And then um, also, you know, different personal trainings and stuff. I've been looking into possibly writing my own book. Um, and so that's coming along really well. I have all of the chapters and everything laid out, and now I just have to actually get to writing. So, um, yeah, lots going on. Lots and lots and lots. I, yeah, lots. So let me guys, let me, let me know you guys. Let me know if you need any help or if you have any questions. Check out my blog, YourSuccessMattersMost.com. It's super duper awesome. It has a lot of stuff on there. Um, all of the affiliate programs that I am associated with are on there. Um, actually, there's a couple that I need to add. Um, but for the most part, they're all on there. So, ah! So much stuff. Oh, goodness. All right, guys. Well, I'm out of here for today. <sighs> I'm out of here. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm going to go hang out with my dog. All right, guys. I will talk to you later. Have a great day. If you like this, like it. Give it a thumbs up. Heart it because now I can do this because I have my phone standing up. Smiley face. Share it. Whatever you got to do. I'll talk to you guys later. You have a fantastic day. We're almost to the weekend, so keep pushing through it. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.